Well, hey folks and welcome to Solar Cabin Channel. I got a fun little project I think uh, you off-gridders, homesteaders, and just anybody will enjoy doing here. Uh, I get all kinds of little critters around my uh, homestead all the time. I get deer and uh, fox, raccoon, uh, skunks, lots and lots of different types of birds. And I've always wanted to try and get pictures of them, but every time I get, get around to grabbing my camera and getting outside, they've either left or I scared them off, so I never get really good pictures. So I decided I wanted to set up a system to monitor the wildlife and birds and things that come around my property, uh, and so I could do it from inside without scaring them off every time I want to take a picture or a video of them. So what you're looking at here, this is my old laptop computer, and uh, I'm using it as a monitoring station, and I'm using an ELP uh, camera that is a USB camera, and I've got it. Ju I'm just using the standard Windows 10 uh, camera interface that you all have on your computers, and this is monitoring uh, what is going. Now there's a bird right there. You can see the, mo the bird just landed. Now what that is that that's my uh, wading pool that I set out every summer for uh, Taz, my dog, so she can get a drink and also get cooled off. But it, it attracts all kinds of wildlife here. And I also put out my uh, chicken feed. When I feed my chickens in the morning and the evening, I sprinkle a little chicken feed because my chickens are free range. And so oh, there's another bird. And so they come and they eat uh, the, the feed that's left over from the chickens. And so all day long, now i got two birds here. And so all day long, I get this wildlife come and visit this little pool right here. And so I set up my uh, ELP little camera. And it costs all of $20 on Amazon. It's USB. It just plugs into your USB port, uh, into the 2.0. It doesn't like the 3.0 port. Use your 2.0 port. And then it comes with 15 feet of cable. And I just run the 15 feet of cable out through my window. And then I can sit here nice and comfortable in the air conditioning and sit and monitor what's going on. And then when I, if I want to take a video or a picture, all I have to do is just click on the buttons over here and snap a picture of them. And then I can uh, save those pictures. See, I just took a picture. Or I could set it for video. And uh, I get to see all the different wildlife without scaring them off. And you could use this for like a hummingbird uh, station if you have hummingbirds. Or maybe you feed, uh, you have a deer feeder or something like that. Or you could use this for monitoring your uh, homestead animals, your chickens and ducks and geese and horses and all that sort of stuff. You could set one of these up to monitor them to see how they're doing, especially if you have animals that are about to uh, have babies. Uh, that would be really neat to be able to watch that because the animals get spooky around people uh, if they're around them when they're having babies. But you could sit and monitor them and watch them, especially for your kids. Great educational experience to watch the animals being born. And you could also use this as a security system. Uh, if you want to, you could set this camera up so that you could monitor your uh, uh, homestead property. You could monitor your driveway to see who's coming in. And this little EMP camera, uh, which I'm going to show you, it uh, has face recognition and uh, motion detection on it. So let's go out and I'll show you what the camera looks like. Now this camera comes with, you can see I've got it running out my window. It comes with uh, 15 feet of cord, uh, USB wire, and I added an additional 20 feet so that I could set this anywhere. And here's old Tazzy Dog. And uh, the camera is just a small little thing. Uh, it's only about the, uh, of the size of, uh, well, yeah, I would say it's probably about two inches by two inches. And it comes with, it's on a swivel, as you can see. It's on a swivel. Now, it's meant to either be permanently mounted or I just mounted it to this two by six uh, block. That way I can move around because I've got almost 35 feet of, of uh, USB cable. I can move this around anywhere. And so it, it swivels either side to side or it swivels up and down so you can adjust it to get your picture just right. It takes really good pictures, really good video. It, it does have uh, motion detection and face recognition, uh, but you'll need the software, which you can download free online. Just look up the motion detection and that software and you can download it. Or you can just use the standard Windows. I just use the Windows camera, which allows you to take pictures and videos of anything you want at any time you want. You can even set it with a timer to take it at any time you want. Now this does not work at night. This doesn't have lights, but you could set it because I have a yard light up there. I have a yard light that comes on with motion detection. So if there was a reason that I wanted to come out and take a picture at night to see what's going on around this little uh, uh, pool here, uh, the motion detector light would come on and then I could probably take a picture. I haven't tried it, but I'm pretty sure I can. So that's the camera. It is made by ELP and it costs $19.99. So for 20 bucks, 
and, and if you want the additional cable, that'll cost you a little bit more. I think I paid about 15 bucks for an additional 20 feet of USB cable. And you can connect that up and then set it around wherever you want to take uh, pictures or videos of. I'm using it as a wildlife monitoring station, but you could set it up, like I said, uh, to monitor uh, anything. Maybe you've got uh, people coming in your driveway, you want to identify them before they get in your driveway, or as a, a homestead security camera, or maybe uh, uh, you want to put it on your chicken coop, or uh, your hummingbird station, or your animal pen so you can see what's going on. That's how you set it up. And uh, for 20 bucks, I think that's a pretty dang good system. And I really enjoy it. It's just a lot of fun because now I can take uh, pictures and videos of the wildlife without scaring them off. And uh, I get uh, deer and raccoons and skunks and all kinds of little critters coming in here all the time. So I'm hoping to get some really good pictures. All right. I hope you enjoyed this video. And, uh, you know, it, it's a, a good project. Under 20 bucks. You can set one of these up on your homestead and have a lot of fun with it. All right, folks. Thanks for coming by my channel. Have a great day.